Right. Welcome back to Good Day. So, Amanda, I just want to make sure you know that one bad apple doesn't spoil the whole bunch, girl. <laughs> and, Stephen, I know how sweet and innocent you are. And I'm leaving it up to, <laughs> I'm leaving it all up to you to explain <laughs> these song references, yeah. what they're about. Okay, so we're talking about <laughs> one of the most iconic entertainers to hit the stage, and he's coming to the Stranahan Theater June 21st. 33 gold records, more than 100 million albums sold, 60 years plus in show business, and women still scream for him to sing Puppy Love. Donny Osmond joins us on Good Day This Morning. It's such a pleasure to see you. Nice to see you, Amanda. How are you doing? <laughs> doing well. So we're talking because you're going to be visiting the Glass City here in Toledo um, in just a little bit in June. So talk about this show. It's a big tour for you. I wanted to bring my award-winning, uh, that sounds egotistical, sorry. I wanted to bring my award-winning show from Las Vegas out on the road because not everybody comes to Las Vegas. And I go. I went against my um, manager's advice, my business manager's advice. They said, you gotta cut the show down, you gotta pare it down so we can tour it and make some money. And I said, no, if this is an award-winning show, I wanna take it on the road as an award-winning show. So I am bringing Las Vegas to Toledo. Holy cow. <laughs> That's it. I, I can yeah. I can imagine all of the, you know, razzle dazzle that goes along with this. You know, how many semi trucks are you bringing through town that day? Uh, I have no idea. I don't even <laughs> want to know. Just bring the show. <laughs> you know, and it's, as you mentioned, an award winning show and folks would love to have seen you in Vegas. So it's wonderful that you're able to take this tour to the people and be able to see you perform. Talk a little bit about what fans will experience when they come and see it. Well, the first thing that comes to my mind is um, there's a segment called the request segment. I've wanted to do this for years, but uh, it's quite unique and kind of scary in a way because it's all improv. But I put all 65 of my albums on the huge screen behind me and the audience can pick any song from any album and we do it just like that. So what's fun for us is the show changes every night based upon what the audience wants to hear. Okay, you said 65 albums, right? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, a lot of, that's, that's a lot, a lot of music. <laughs> that's a lot of music. How do you keep? How do you remember all these songs? Well, sometimes I don't. <laughs> the other night, somebody asked for, and I think she was trying to, to stump me, but uh, she asked for this one deep album album cut. I think it was on my first album. Amanda, I don't even remember recording it, right? I said, I don't remember the words. And she said, I've got the words on my phone, so I sang it from the phone. Improv. <laughs> it, was, it was quite funny. It, it totally improv. There you but go. Thinking quick on your feet. Because they just throw song after song and we just do them. whatever they ask for. We, we do it. Wow. So you have the other thing. Go ahead. The other, the other thing that I love doing in the show is uh, I, I love seeing the reactions on some of the faces when I start singing, let's get down to business, song from uh, Mulan. Mm -hmm. A lot of people don't know that I'm Captain Shang. In right. So when my dancers and I start doing the dancing, and we actually use the Disney film in the theater, we turn the theater into a Mulan experience. It, that's kind of a cool moment as well. Um, I, the other moment that's become a fan favorite is the rap that I do. It's a 10 minute rap and very, very fast, but it covers everything I've done in six decades of show business. And you actually see on the screens what I'm rapping about. It's, it's pretty cool. You can literally do it all. You, you're rapping for 10 minutes. <laughs> well, I can't sing opera like Marie can, but that's... <laughs> There's a, she's got that, right? Uh, and, she's got and, that. and beautiful uh, in her own right. So uh, this yeah. is going to be a, a great show for people to come out. And I think, as you mentioned, Mulan, for instance, I've got a six-year-old at home. We also are fans of the Mass Singer program as well. I, the, I was the, the first, peacock. yeah, I was the first Mass Singer as the Peacock. That's right. So families yeah. can come out because they're going to, they're going to, oh, yeah, I know that guy. <laughs> A lady told me this the other day uh, after the show, and it really put the whole thing into perspective. She said, I not, not only saw your whole life flash before my eyes, I saw my own life flash before my eyes because I lived all those experiences with you and some that I totally forgot about. So it's six decades in one show, just one thing after the other. What do you love so much about taking that stage every night? It's the people, I mean, it's the synergy. You could show up to the theater dead tired, but when that curtain goes up and the music starts and the lights hit you and you feel that energy from the audience, it's euphoric. It's, to it's the perfect word. It's euphoric. And especially when 
they're with you and you've got them in the palm of your hands and you take them on this journey this two-hour journey because uh, i call show business escapism these people come to the theater to escape and to just have fun and just relive memories and, and just be entertained so for uh for two hours that's what we do that's and i've quite a show. the two dancers hours. the band um Everybody just gives 110% on stage. So you'll be here at the Stranahan Theater in Toledo on June 21st. So people, make sure you get online, you get your tickets now. Well, uh, the best best way to remember that, Amanda, mm -hmm. is go to Donnie.com. There you go. Donnie.com. I mean, because yeah. what what other Donnie is there that can claim the, claim well, the website Donnie.com? Yeah, well, I, I, I set that aside for me when I invented <laughs> the Internet back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can't wait to have you here in the Glass City, and we hope you truly enjoy your stay while you're here. Thanks, Amanda. Appreciate it. Yes, pleasure speaking with you today.